where concerned legislative aides in the Ninth National Assembly have submitted petitions to the Economic and Financial Crimes Commission, as well as the Independent Corrupt Practices and Other Related Offences Commission. They are accusing the clerk to the National Assembly, Amos Ojo, of diverting their entitlements. The legislative aides marched to the gates of the two anti-graft agencies in a peaceful protest to complain about the non-payment of their salaries and arrears, despite several complaints to the management of the National Assembly. Today's Wadiwe reports. Another round of protests by legislative aides in the National Assembly. This time, they have taken their demonstration a notch higher by registering their grievances at the Nigerian anti-graft agencies. They carried placards with various inscriptions and marched to the gates of the Economic and Financial Crimes Commission and the Independent Corrupt Practices Commission to table their petitions. They want the anti-graft agencies to investigate an alleged diversion of their entitlement by the clerk to the National Assembly and presiding officers. Over this same issue, legislative aid had protested at the National Assembly about three times. And at one time, the Speaker of Parliament addressed the protesters and promised that this issue, it was, according to him in his words, he said it was unconscionable for eight of the National Assembly to be owed their rightful wages, wages as important as salaries, what they rightfully deserve. And that he gave us a time limit, he said in a very short time, a very short time should have been three to six months, but this is about one full year since that protest. And the salary areas of 2019 are yet to be cleared. The aides also called for transparency in the management of legislative aides account to avoid breach of the Fiscal Responsibility Act 2007. The petition was also copied to the President, Muhammadu Buhari, the Vice President, the Inspector General of Police and the Director General of the State Security Service. Tijesu Adeo News, Abuja.